You read with uh, Ted Sinjin. Yes. Who had his own short-lived spectacular political career. Yeah. Uh, what was it like reading with Ted and uh, did you did you appear as junior to him at any stage or observe him much no, in court? No, I never appeared. I, did. I don't think I was... Oh, wait a minute. Yes, but not while I was reading with him. Uh, uh, he's a lovely bloke, Ted, and a very good equity lawyer. But by, that, by the time that Ted led me in it, it was in a tenancy case with, a, with some equity some equity sideline and I remember grinding my teeth when, when he was cross-examining because I was used to my father cross-examining and this the skill of the common lawyer and equity in those days anyway as I wouldn't be publishing this in those days anyway uh, equ equity equity hooks weren't great cross-examiners well this was a very different sort of area of and it wasn't their sort of uh, requirement I suppose in those days was quite different from what it is now it's so it's ma much more formal now I mean there was no such thing as the readers course to to learn the skills of being at the bar you just picked them up you um, you spend I, time in the rough and tumble atmosphere at the petty yes, sessions yes, courts yes and and in that in that Area, um, someone of the of the of the seniority of, and, and of the equity skills of Ted was not, you know, was not. Uh, well, I didn't have to call on him very often for help. Uh, now uh, that sounds terribly critical. I don't mean to. I don't mean to be that. It was just that that was the way the bar was at that time. You, know, you were you were so busy running around the suburban courts. Uh, uh, unless you were someone like Roddy Ma, who never went to a suburban court, he decided he was going to be equity from, from the moment he started, and that's what he did. Um, uh, another very uh, one of the somewhat somewhat senior to, my, to me uh, was David Yeldham. He had a very big tenancy practice, uh, but he he suddenly said, "I'm not going to go to petty sessions any longer." Uh, not long after I came to the bar. Um, and he didn't. He he um, stuck to uh, Supreme Primarily Equity Court. And and Roddy, he and Roddy, had the the skills, the capacity, the brains, and the background to be able to do to be able to make that decision and make it stick. Whereas some of the rest of us um, had to had to muddle through.